Hey everyone, welcome to another Vigaro tutorial. In this video we'll be going over add-ons. Here we are on the services and classes menu. To get here, tap on more, tap on settings, and under things we sell, tap on services slash classes. For this example, let's choose services. Before we begin, note that add-ons upgrade a current service and they are separate from services with the same name. Here we tap add and then add-on category. Here you input your category name. You can select whether the add-on category will have one or multiple add-ons. If you select multiple add-ons, you can set a minimum and maximum selection for customers to choose from. Next, you can select whether the add-on is required by clicking this toggle button here. Once you are ready, tap Create. Now we can see the add-ons category on your list. You can identify them with the add-ons icon here. Next, we need to insert the actual add-ons to the add-ons category. We can tap on it and select add-on. Here is where we build our add-on. First, we write a name and description for the add-on. Select the add-ons category it belongs to. Assign it to your services. Input any business cost or tax that is applicable. Next, toggle on show add-on online if you want a customer to view it online without a price. If you want the price to show, tap show add-on price online. Next, set your price, duration, points given, and points required to redeem this add-on. Finally, add your photo to display your add-on more nicely. When you are ready, tap save. Classes add-on will be the same steps, except you cannot change the duration of the class. Now once an add-on is created, you can always add it to a different service or class. You simply tap a service, tap edit, and under add-on suggested, you can apply add-ons, to be suggested for customers booking this service. Next, I'll show you how to delete an add-on or add-on category. Now simply tap on the add-on or add-on category you want to delete and tap delete. One thing to note about deleting add-ons on the app is that you cannot delete add-ons that are attached to packages, memberships, or discounts. You will have to do that using your desktop. If you want to convert an existing service into an add-on, this can be done by tapping the service and selecting convert to add-on. Tap confirm, and we can see the services is now an add-on. Now whenever a customer books an appointment, they'll get a pop-up window suggesting the add-ons you selected to help increase your checkout totals. And the same thing will happen if it is an in-house checkout when you're booking a new appointment or checking out a customer. Now we're all done here. This video is all about using add-ons. If this video was helpful, be sure to like and comment below. Also, subscribe to the channel to pick up more tips and tricks about the software. Check out the description to follow our social media channels or to start your free trial of Regards today.